Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to let you know about another change that Microsoft um, could be making and bringing to the sidebar and the site panel in the Edge web browser on desktop. Now the sidebar has rolled out to the stable version as I have been posted on and I think that was um, just after the release of version 103 and uh, in the Edge Canary browser, the preview version of Edge, as I have been posting on, and Microsoft has been giving the sidebar a lot of attention and the side panel, and they've added a whole lot of uh, different new quick action buttons and social media platforms, as I have been posting on. And some of these uh, social media platforms um, have rolled out to the stable version, as I have mentioned previously over the last um, couple of weeks. Now, the new change um, that Microsoft could be making regarding the sidebar and the side panel is that now in Edge Canary, you are able to resize the side panel. So if I just head to um, my YouTube page, um, which I've just placed as a quick action um, in the sidebar, if I hover over the border of the side panel, you'll see the two-way arrow which now lets me resize the side panel to my own personal choice and preference. Now, just one thing uh, to take note of um, at this stage in Edge Canary is that um, the default um, quick actions like your, your search, discover, tools, games, office, and outlook, you cannot resize. So if I just go to the tools as an example, you'll see there is no option to uh, resize the side panel and for those default quick actions that Microsoft did roll out this. Resizing the site panel now only applies to sites, as I've demonstrated, that you add manually, uh, like my YouTube uh, page. So as mentioned, if you add a site manually, you can um, resize the site panel for that site. And also this applies to all other apps. So as an example, um, if I just head to Spotify and I just enable that in the sidebar and I click on it, you can see now that I can also resize other apps like Spotify, just to mention another example. So um, at this stage, though, it's not known uh, if this feature will actually roll out to the stable version where you are able to resize um, the, the side panel when you activate a quick action button in the sidebar. But um, if anything does change, um, I will obviously let you know and post accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.